Hey guys, God bless. Welcome back to Twist and Shout. I am Char. And y'all, I am three months, almost four months in breastfeeding. Yeah. Y'all should know on the news and stuff and the posts and stuff on social media that there is a demand for formula. Like formula is sold out everywhere. And it's crazy because y'all, last month almost took me out of here. I was like, girl, your latch hurt. I'm pumping too much, you greedy. I was like, man, something gotta give. And y'all, um, it seems like I told y'all, um, there's a situation where for whatever reason, I don't know what it is about me, but my insurance is not trying to send me a breast pump. I don't know what in the world's going on. I don't call them twice. I even got as far as to get on the phone with someone and got um, gave them my mailing address and got my doctor to do a referral to them, letting them know that yes, I am breastfeeding, that I'm not receiving formula, nothing. That was over a month, like my God, like my child been dead by now if I was waiting on y'all. That's a whole nother story, I'm talking about another video, but I just feel like for them to be, ah, oh, breastfeeding is the best thing you can do for your child. You're not helping us. There's no mental support, no physical support. You're not, I, me personally, in a perfect ideal world, I think a, a hospital grade pump should be available as soon as I said I'm breastfeeding. And obviously there's evidence of that because I'm in a hospital and I'm not asking you guys for a formula, I'm breastfeeding. But anyway, there's this challenge going on. Well, I'm creating this challenge and hopefully it works for people because I hope it works for me. And if it was a bust, I'm gonna go ahead and put it out there. But anyway, there's a lot of, you know, tricks and trades that people say will increase your milk supply. Me personally, I know that two foods that are guaranteed to increase my supply instantly is <laughs> pizza and ice cream. Don't know what it is. I just know it works. Like, and I and the crazy thing is I have a craving for ice cream almost every day. And I, I want pizza almost every day, but that's not realistic and it gives her bad gas. So yeah. But I seen this post about body armor. I'm assuming the coconut water in here is what's actually increasing the milk supply because I've seen the coconut water mentioned in another post to actually do that. But on this video, I need everybody that has breastfeed, currently breastfeeding, a nurse, whatever, comment on this post and let the people know what actually works, including myself, because this is a real deal. Like, not only are we rushing off of a pandemic, but like I said, we have a shortage on formula. So even those who are struggling and they're not getting the support that they need and they're, they want to quit, they want to give up. Like I, I have somebody in real life, I know that they were in the process of weaning their child off of the boob and going to formula. And now they're like, oh, no, wait, you know, there's a shortage of formula. So comment below if you have any ideas, any legit things that will help us moms create more milk. But the post said, drink this. Um, I ain't gonna lie, I can't remember if it's like drink the whole thing or not, but it did say pump within the next hour or you will see results in the next hour. Me, because I'm pumping around the clock, even two, three o'clock in the morning, I'm not gonna pump in an hour because I know my boob is gonna hurt. They're already gonna hurt, but that'll make them raw. So they, the standard is they say, if you're gonna breastfeed and feed to wait 30 minutes in between, but honey, even if I wait an hour, that's not gonna work for me. So I'm gonna, wait my normal little pumping time and I'm gonna come back and see or if I get the feeling in my boob where I'm like I gotta pump right here right now I'm gonna let you guys I'm gonna come back and show you guys right now I'm gonna show y'all my empty bottles they empty they hold um almost they hold six ounces technically but the line is five ounces and because I pump round the clock um I have burst like I have that nighttime about to go to bed burst where I can get about five a piece or four a piece and then the first thing in the morning i get five four four five something like that but in between the day i'm getting like two and a half three out of each boob so i'm gonna show you guys what i'm gonna have right now i had a pretty good breakfast haven't had lunch or anything but that's life i drunk some water not a lot so brace yourself it might, i might even not even get two ounces per boob but i did technically double pump this morning i got five and four and then right before I left the house, I got uh, two and two. So we'll see how this goes. We're gonna see if this actually works, you guys. I'm gonna drink this after I pump this time. I'm gonna show you before and I'm gonna show you after. And this is from someone who pumps regularly and um, eat decently enough. Like I'm not starving myself. I am not trying to be cute and be all small because this is not the time for this. 
you are still feeding for two, my friend. So if you're trying to dad right now, psh, then that's on you. Now, I'm not the type to be bashing mothers and women, things of that nature, but some things are common sense. If you had to feed for two while you were pregnant because the baby was in you, what in the world do you think you have to do when the baby's out of you? Like, that, isn't, that doesn't go anywhere. Like, you barely probably consume enough calories for yourself with the needs of your body now, especially going through all those changes. So, duh, if after you have the baby, you still have to take care of yourself, still have to take your prenatal vitamins. That is a given. I highly recommend that. Um, or even take women's or adult vitamins, something, because you need extra because you're giving out extra. And hence, um, just in case you're worrying about weight and all this in nature, um, pumping burns 200 calories. Breastfeeding burns 200 calories per session. So if you're worrying about all this and jazz, if you eat your three solid meals and you pump or you breastfeed and she's feeding at least three times a day, I, I can guarantee you that you're fine in the, cal in the calorie category. Like, don't sweat it. Right now I'm gonna pump, I'm not gonna preach because that's for another video. So let's go, let's, let's get this over with, okay? Okay, guys, I'm back. All right, so just to show you very quickly, this is this side. This is this side. Um, I'm right at three ounces on this side. And let me get closer so you guys can see. I kind of don't want to get it close because it's kind of personal. You may say it's just milk, but it's like it's the smell that came from me. <laughs> but okay, so that's right at three ounces. Um, and then this one is like two and a half. Okay, so used to that, used to the inconsistently, inconsistent C. <laughs> but anyway, so now that I've done that, I pumped. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Now I'm gonna crack this open on camera so you guys can see. There you go, random. That's another thing too. Oh, this is so good. Make sure. Um you have something to drink at least after um either before or after i think they recommend after and it's because you're pulling liquid from you and you get dehydrated just like you would if you were sweating so you have to drink this is my downfall that a lot of times i'm just like oh i gotta hurry up and pump like before i leave the house before i go somewhere or before i do this before i do that if i could dinner da, da, da. so i don't take time to drink and i've been slacking a whole lot but that's about to change This is so good. I may very well finish this, but I want it colder, so I'm gonna put it in the fridge. Mm -hmm. So I'm about 10% coconut water in here, by the way. I'm about right here. So I'm gonna come back on camera and I'm gonna let you guys see the difference, right? And I don't plan on eating anything, maybe a banana, but banana doesn't get me milk. <laughs> Um, it's just that I didn't have a lunch and I don't want to, and I got to take my prenatal vitamin, but, um, so yeah, one final hoorah. Um, I'm gonna put this in a bottle and she doesn't seem hungry right now, which is good because if I can freeze it, perfect. Cause what's been happening is like, I get right at the end of the night and I'm so poop and pump and tired that I go to sleep. I don't pump no more or I fall asleep and I don't wake up in the middle of the night. Um, and that probably has has effects on my pumping too. But yeah, so stay tuned and I'm gonna come back and show you, uh, I'm gonna get clean bottles and I'm gonna show you guys the difference. So two and a half, three, two and a half, three. Um, so far I've drunk this much right here of this bottle and hopefully it'll be done by the time I come back and we'll see if it makes a difference because I'm just trying to help people like, this is a topic and a situation that a lot of people, they're not, which I understand because it's, it's humbling. It's a shame. Like at first I was like, do I really want to show y'all my before? Because to me, this is kind of heartbreaking because I'm so used to being up here for so long. So it, it does make you feel like way, makes you feel inadequate um, that you're not producing um, enough. But um, we pray you do what you can and then you leave the rest in God's hand. But I'm going to be back with results after the fact so stay tuned you guys okay this is this side barely two ounces in my face not even two ounces it's like it, it's tilted because i'm trying to show you but it's like right above you see that 
right above the line. That's this side. Right above, below two ounce line. That's not even my normal, like. I don't know what to say, but it ain't work for me. I mean, I'm gonna come back and if I got any more footage or any more updates, I'm gonna put it in the comment section or description box. But right now, it's like, it didn't work. I don't know, maybe I need to wait till later, but that's not gonna be fair because I'm about to eat dinner. I don't know, child. I don't know. Comment below if it worked for you. It didn't work for me. Disappointed. Bella crying. She wants some milk. And I gotta get her this. So, well, I got extra from earlier. So, but tell me what you guys think. What, like I said, please don't forget to comment anything that actually helped you, um, that helped someone else. Like any advice to help any mamas out there, please drop in the comment section because. We need to help these mamas. We need to help one another. We are a village. I love you guys. God bless. Take care. Bye.